How are you doing today? Well, I hope. Today we have a PSA return. I thought it would be fun to kind of showcase what I do on my time when I get cards back. And there are three things I like to go over, I, I just from my own knowledge. One, first and foremost, is going to be the raw value of the card when I sent it off to grade. Second is going to be the raw value at the time I get it back. The third thing I look at is the slab value at the time of return. I grade a lot of lower rank cards as well. Cards that come in, you know, I know they're going to come in at a four or five or six, a seven, um, but they're older cards. Uh, they're, they're stuff that I, I see as a piece of Pokemon history and it may not be in the greatest, greatest condition, but whatever condition I find it in, uh, I, I want to preserve where it's at right now. For me, again, I think it's cool. The lower grade cards don't care. They're old. I appreciate them. I like them. I enjoy them. Further ado, let's get into it. I'm tired of talking. Let's see. Did, I did crack the box just to not have to fumble, fumble around here on screen. But other than that, I have not seen the grades. Uh, I have not... PSA has a great system, uh, digitally on your phone, your computer, to go and, and look at the grades before they're actually back to you. Uh, I'm going into this blind, so no idea, no idea what we're we're looking at. Honestly, I forgot what the submission actually entails, so we uh, we'll go through this together. Hopefully, good grades, but again, grades not always the important thing. So. First off, let me see, a little bit of whitening, bottom portion, but let's see what it is, and, ooh, Typhlosion, let's make sure you guys can see that, 2019 promo, Black Star promo, okay, three pack blister, and a seven, hmm. okay, very cool. I do, I do like the promos. Um, Blackstar promos probably more than set cards a lot of the time, uh, because if you do manage to find one of these older boxes intact, it's really hard to to want to crack it and get break the seals. Awesome as that is, um, but 2019 is not that old. I'm talking older than that, but. Same thing applies. I do like the the Black Star promos as far as going and getting them graded that way. If I ever am lucky enough to come across an older box, I I want the card. I don't feel the need to crack the box just to get the promo. So let's see what we got next. Okay, I'm just gonna go right into it. 2017 Black Star Mewtwo. Very cool. An eight. I'm happy with it. Eights and nines from my, my per personal collection. That's I'm happy. I'm stoked. I'll take lower than that if it's an old card. But tens. Everybody, everybody loves tens. But eights and nines are good. Solid. Let's see, price is going to be going up here on the screen. I'm not sure where I'm going to put them. Let's go with Raw value at time of submission here. Raw value, time of return. Slap value at time of return. We'll go with that, yeah? Of course, you guys will already know that. That's the second card. I'll have had it up on the screen already. Oh, yes, yes. This is cool, this is special. So, for those of you who don't know, back uh, a long time ago, we'll show that off. 1999 Blockbuster Video Promo. Used to be able to go in Pokemon Snap when it was out on the N64. You could go into Blockbusters and they had machines. A lot of Poketubers have them. Uh, Pokerev and Leonhart come to mind. I uh, have them in the background. But um, you'd go in, you'd play, you, you'd be able to get a little printout and you'd get these cards as well. Uh, it was my first, my first job. And so, yeah, it's uh, special to me. Blockbuster, anyway. 
and Pokemon. So for me, it's a win-win and a nine. I, again, perfection. I don't need I don't need ten. It's it's a great card, and I'm happy. Value value on those. I have no idea. I have no idea. Here's another one. I have no idea where these blockbuster cards are sitting. You will, you will, in the future, see what the uh, three price points tend to be or were. Charmander nine, perfect. I, I did send in others. I think that's all the blockbuster cards I have in this submission. I do have others that are uh, waiting, waiting, waiting on a grading. So that should be it for the blockbuster cards. But very cool. Again, my first job. Soft spot in my heart. Let's see. Ooh, okay, we got our first 10. Nice. Okay. A, a, a Again, a Black Star promo. Nice. Malavios. Let's, let's make sure you guys can see that. Wow. A 10. I'm stoked. Perfect. That is cool. I need... No. I actually... No. I don't know. Is there a Latias? EX promo? I don't remember. If there is, I don't have it. I need to find one. And submit it. A 10. Wow. First 10 of the video. I'm I'm stoked. And let's see what the next one is. Char is already... Uh, see, yeah. Okay. Very cool. Again, I got a thing for, for Blackstar promos. And an 8. Very cool from the Detective Pikachu movie. That's, that's cool. I, I like, I, I like, I lot. I don't know what that was. Ignore that. What do we got next? Nice. I came, I came across that, came in, in an eight. That's okay. An eight's okay. It's a cool card. I do have a stack of these though. So this shouldn't be the last one in this submission. I think we may have one or two following this. Um, I, in this submission, there's some. I have a second submission after this that has some, and then I still have more here. I came across a whole stack of them at a, a flea market. And again, the Black Star promos are really, really freaking cool. The boxes comes in, I do have both. Um, the, the Espeon Deoxys box, as well as the Umbreon Darkrai box. And they're crazy. They're like, they're like, right now, I think I checked a couple months ago when I sent these off. They're four or five hundred dollars a box. No, I don't want to crack. I, I don't want to crack it. I'm okay. Just look, I, I, it's not my first one either. We got more. We got more coming up. That's an eight. Can we get a nine or a ten? I figured, I figured eight, eights and nines usually for these. Let's see what we got. Okay, that's that that's not him. Hopefully oh, I I'm pretty sure I have others. Tapu Coco, another Black Star promo, a nine. And again, not not a big flashy card. Uh, we'll have values as well, you know, here on screen. I, I don't I appreciate grading for value and I for my personal collection with certain things. Modern. Um, the older, older things. 2017, it's, it's getting, getting, getting along. Um, I want to preserve it. It's Pokemon history. So I, I want it to be in as good a condition as it is, as it is now. And it can be, and be around to be appreciated. Yes. Yes. Okay. There we go. Okay, so this must be the Black Star promo area. Um, yeah, PSA 10 tag team, very cool, beautiful card, beautiful. Maybe, maybe, maybe this one has multiple of the Umbreon and the Umbreon and Deoxys and the following submissions had multiple of the Espeon Deoxys. I think that's what's going on. See what this one is. Pikachu and Zekrom in a nine. Yeah, very cool. Super stoked. Another Black Star promo. 
gorgeous. Isn't she gorgeous? Ooh, okay. Came across this at a, a flea market. French as well. But Neo Genesis, man. 2001, I couldn't pass it up. I knew it wasn't in the greatest condition. But again, grading, make a few bucks. with Some cards is cool, but this is not. This is not for that. This is to preserve Pokemon history. Keep it as good as it is. And now... Now it has a new home. French. First. Yeah, no, that is that is my first French card I've ever come across, ever, ever owned that I'm aware of. Neo Genesis. Come on. Not not a bad one either. And another and another one. A 10. A 10. Nice. Lucario and Mel Metal. I doubt it's one of the most expensive tag teams, but the tag teams themselves have been going up. So maybe, maybe price point here is respectable. Not that this is going anywhere. This is this is home now. Tens? No, that's 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 staying here. No, no contest. Another promo. Okay. 2018 Suicune Lost Thunder pre-release promo. An eight. Cool. Yard sale find for this one. Had a had a handful of of, uh, of cards that this this came with. Uh, only three, three hollows that this came with, and a handful of non hollows. And an eight though. Not bad for uh, an unsleeved. You know bottom of a box yard sale find. Mewtwo EX Evolutions. Very cool. Now, this should be a set of Evolutions that I had purchased a collection and some of the cards I thought were grade worthy. This is our first one. I, I am assuming Evolutions Mewtwo and a 9. Very cool. Perfection. See, that's all we need. Tens are icing on the cake, but nines, nines are, nines are solid, nines are good. Okay, here we go, Venusaur, and a nine, and a nine, perfect, we are just talking about it. Very cool. Mega Venusaur EX Evolutions. Yeah, whole collection for uh, $189, not bad. Misty. Okay, and a nine. Okay, very, very cool. There should be Charizards in here, too. I didn't put them in order. Maybe they didn't put them in order. I don't know. Very cool. So I do have a complete XY Evolutions binder. Um, but I, I like doing binder master sets and slab master sets. So these ones, that's what they'll be going for. Ooh, okay, Clara. This is from the uh, premium tournament collection. The uh, the milk. I don't know what this is. Hang loose. The uh, the milk carton in a nine. And if I am correct, Japan still has not got that card. Maybe I don't know. I mean, it's a Sword and Shield era card. Maybe they'll put it out in the upcoming shiny set that's coming out. December, December 1st, but it's been a year of Scarlet and Violet and they still don't have a Sword and Shield Era card. I don't know. Kind of sucks. Okay. A 9. Perfect. Good with that. Again, I, I wanted it for Slab. Slab Master Set. And No, I need, I need a Slab of the Pokemon Center stamped one as well. Ooh, okay, okay, a 10, nice, hyper rare, very cool, Japanese, very cool, Starbirth, I think Jill and I were opening Starbirth, and that's where this card came from, Gem Mint 10, perfect, love it, that'll, 
That'll fit nicely in with the collection. What else do we got? Unigarba. There should be some, not, not all the Unigarba. I did split some. Some went to BGS, some went to PSA now, and then some went to PSA on a later submission, but a 10. <laughs> Espeon, Espeon. Very cool Unigarba promo. I was lucky enough to order from the Pokemon Center and got quite a few. Ooh, another 10. Very cool. Jolteon, Unigarba. Of course, Jill. Jill took. Yeah, she took a full master set of the uh, the raw the raw promo cards. Um, and then I have a raw master set binder, and everything that went off to submission is here in this order, and the next order for PSA as well as uh, Beckett. That's all. It's all extras. So very cool. This was the. Was this? The, Restaurant I'm in charge of. Was that the Walmart box or the GameStop box? One of them. One of them came out. There were two, and I forget which is which. I think this was the GameStop box. But a nine. Perfect. Very cool. That's a win. It's a win right there. Let's see. We got. What do we got? Ooh, Gyarados. Okay. Black Star promo, and then eight. XY106. Okay, very cool. Good card. 2016. So, getting, getting up there. Here we go. Here we go. Nice. And an 8. Okay, that's not. It's okay. 8s are good. Not what we want. We want 9s. And 10s are over the top. Very cool, but 8s eight, a good card. Again, this box. Last time I checked, months ago was four fifty, four sixty, pushing five hundred dollars. <gasps> Yikes! Another Unigarba. Okay. Espeon in a ten. Very cool. Beautiful card. The whole Unigarba line. I was lucky enough to. I, sh I should have picked up more. I think I have it here. No, I do have it here. Uh, when it first came out. And nobody, nobody freaking cared. Nobody gave it no, you know, no attention. It was, I think I paid $2.30, $2.30 for the card raw on eBay. Got it from Japan, sent it off, got it graded. I should have picked up more because now they're nasty. They're, they're, <sighs> last time I checked anyway, I don't know about current prices. I'll, I'll put it up here just, just to, just to do it. But yeah, no, it was it, it it got up there, a lot more than two dollars and thirty cents. Another ten, Glaceon, very cool, and it came in in a, a ten. Come on, does not get any better. This doesn't get any better either, unless it were a BGS black label. That would be better. It would be, but I'm not that brave. Unless I think it's absolute, absolutely immaculate, no flaws, and then. I've never, I've never actually gotten a black label on cards. I swear to God, they're freaking perfect. I swear. And just, no, 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 no. <sighs> One day, I'm, I'm gonna get a black label. Seven. This was another flea market find. Cleaned it up as best I could. Sent it in a seven. It's okay, it's a good card. 2015, no shame in that. Happy to preserve the card as is. But another 10 is also good, yeah. Sylveon. Again, the Unigarba. Unigarba line. Very cool. There she go. Oh, yes. This one I picked up two years ago. Um, five dollars <laughs> yeah uh that that was a good buy i think it's definitely worth more than five dollars now i bought a collection of stuff and had three or four of these japanese pokemon center cards that were included for like five bucks each so uh yeah 
No, definitely worth more than that now. I'm, I'm guessing in the uh, the hundreds of dollars. Two, maybe, maybe hundred, two hundred. We'll see. Ballpark in two hundred. That would be cool. In a nine, by the way. Another Unigarba. In an eight. It's okay. Vaporian. I don't know if we have another one in here. I don't know. We shall see. That may be more one. We shall see. Here's another 10 for another Sylveon. Okay, very cool. So we, again, doubled up on a few of these. I sent in all my extras that didn't either go in my master, you know, my master set, my vault -Tex. There, I was wondering where he was. It's my XY Evolutions Charizard. Came back in an eight. Part of the collection I bought. It's okay. Um, I It's my first slabbed XY Evolution Charizard. So, unless I get one better, he will do. That'll do donkey. Should be the reverse in here as well. In an eight. That's... I'm happy with that. A seven, I would have been a little bummed because I both the hollow and the reverse. I think and should have deserved an eight or nine. So I'm I'm okay. I'm okay with that. This let's see if the, if this is the reverse. If that got an eight, the, the reverse is gonna get an eight as well. Yeah. Okay. It's okay. It's good. It's good. An eight. An eight is good. Okay. Happy with an eight cool card it's again the first slabbed xy evolution charizard uh hollow or reverse that i that i have in my collection so i'm happy that's cool Ooh, skyla in an eight where did i pulled this one yeah that's pack fresh pack fresh in an eight it's okay eight's good well, that'll go with the collection we're almost done. Oh, okay, another and and another one, another ten. Let's make sure you can see them. Yeah, Espeon. Another ten. Unigarba. Not sure what I'm gonna do with the duplicates. One will go in the slab master set for that collection, and another ten. The others, maybe some profit to put back into the channel. Maybe I'll keep some for giveaways though. Leafy on, very cool. I think I'll keep, if I do have multiples, I'll keep one. One giveaway. And then one to make some money on. Eevee in a 10. Most of these Unigarvas came back. Chef's kiss. Perfect. Very cool. That's that. I got them for free for buying off Pokemon Center. Japan, not, not US. That's. That's cool. There's an I. Why are they? Why are they not together? PSA. Why the Why are the cards separated? I know I sent them chronological order. All the black stars chronologically. All the sets together chronologically. Why Why you guys get my OCD is not digging it. In a ten. <laughs> Didn't even see that. Wow. See, I knew I had another one. In a ten. Yes. Wow. Beautiful card, man super happy that's a good one that's a good one right there what else uh, another eve in a 10 eve in a 10 unit uh, the unit garba cards man the quality on these japanese just tend to come in better better quality a seven okay uh, let's see 2016 xy Black Star promo. I picked this on, picked this up on eBay. Six dollar, six, yeah, six bucks. Uh, free shipping, winning bid. So I'm sure, I'm sure. Justification. We'll, we'll look at the numbers, but I'm, I'm sure that justifies. Hopefully, it's Charizard. Come on, Black Star promo. Should, should justify what uh, what it costs to grade it and buy it. But this. Perfection. Again, the Unigarba cards in a 10. Come on. Vaporeon. Yes. We are almost done. 
Let's see, what else? Another, another Vaporeon and another 10. Come on. <sighs> Japanese cards, man. Killing it. They're stacked up. I hope they don't fall. I will be very sad. Let's see. Let's work around all the, ooh. Work around all the tens because they're piling up. We've gotten quite quite a few, and here's another one. Jolteon Unigarba. I'm gonna put that down there. I'm gonna pull, pull the rest of these. Make it. Oh, we saw what that one was. And Flareon, another PSA 10. Good, good submission, man. Good submission. Come on. I'm, I am super curious to see the uh, the values on these. Ooh, okay. That was a uh, another in a nine. Okay, very cool. So that was another card from the uh, complete, oh, nearly complete X Y Evolution Master Set that I bought in a nine. Okay, not bad. Not bad. Let's see, we got two more. Are they both Japanese? No, a Japanese and an English. <sighs> a Japanese has a higher chance of being a good card with its grade. So we'll go with English. We'll go with English. Who do we got? Oh my god! Rayquaza, come on! I don't care. Great card. Cool card. A four though, come on! Really? Where do you get a four? Moments like these, I, I wish PSA did subgrades, because... Uh, yeah, he's... Beat up there on the bottom. Uh, that's... That's here. Uh, must have been that. Must have been that right there. But a four? The front looks... You can see front looks great but again i don't care i'm not i'm not grading cards like this to turn up a, a, you know, a profit for, for value um 2015 black star you know promo it's it's pokemon history i appreciate it i want to preserve it in the condition it's at right now as best as i can this is how i do it um hopefully, hopefully others out you know I, I know there's quite a few people that, that grade cards and you know, not in it for the value. I think that is cool, and I appreciate it. I do the same thing. I hope you do too. Because again, it's it's a piece of Pokemon history. Let's see what we got. What is the last one? In a ten. In a ten. Yes. Master Ball. Very cool. Volpex is not the last one. I have. A handful. I have some at BGS. I have more at PSA. In a ten. Wow. That's that's got to be worth a pretty penny. Very cool. Good. 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 Good something. Good win. Good buy. Yeah, I did. Bought it off eBay. Back before they skyrocketed. That first week, just bought as much as I could. Ten, fifteen dollars each. Whatever. Right there. That's it for now. I appreciate you all sitting down with me, going through the, uh, the PSA returns. Uh, I'm going to throw up numbers all here, where they have been. Total value of the raw cards that were submitted. Total value of the raw cards the day they came back. And total value, roughly estimated, of the slabs and what they're worth. Um, again, I'm not in it purely to, to make a profit. 80 80 percent of it is from my personal collection um, but i numbers you know I, I do i find it interesting and hopefully you do too um thank you all for stopping by watching i hope you have a great day take care we'll see you next time be safe bye